Hey everyone, Jamie Phillips here with you. Action Auto Parts. Uh, Saturday morning, and I'm waiting on a good buddy of mine. Uh, he should be here about any minute. And uh, he was here the other day, which I was busy. I'd sold uh, my old zero turn mower, so I had that guy getting it and and whatever. But uh, old Paul Miller, as I call it, uh, we found out why I wasn't. Uh, wouldn't run and was leaking gas gas tank had two little pinholes uh in it so we got it dropped and uh i ordered a new one from advanced auto parts and so it is in i also went ahead and got a new uh the fuel filter inline fuel filter and even though it was working while we was under it i went ahead and bought a new fuel pump so uh ran to town this morning and got about eight gallon of gas and so when mike gets here uh we're gonna try to get the uh the new gas tank on get it strapped back up uh put the fuel pump in and the filter uh gas in it hopefully then that'll have this truck running like i think it's gonna run i think it's gonna be a good one for me uh i hadn't ever cleaned it up it's kind of the way i bought it tires definitely got to be replaced but uh, i wanted to see how it was going to run first so it's 89 f-150 uh 306 cylinder four speed overdrive uh just a rubber mat dual tanks but it's one owner truck that i bought uh gentleman passed in 2013 i'd done a video back earlier if you get a chance you want to go back and watch it but uh last year's license was 2013 and so uh got it transferred it's in my name so i got a good clean title to it if it runs like i think it's going to because i've had it running a little bit and it was just so quiet man it was just awesome then i will invest in some new tires and the headliners sagging in there which my good buddy jack ray will help me fix that and the seat on the driver's side is bad so uh going to get those repaired but one hundred six thousand uh actual miles on it and uh so yeah it's gonna make it's gonna make a good truck i believe but so spend a little money on it like i said new tank new fuel pump new fuel filter we'll get that going and then uh maybe this coming week if that does fix the problem it runs good and all of that then i'll check on getting some tires for it and drive it a little bit make sure all the bugs has worked out of it kind of get the, you know those type of things done and then I'll focus on the headliner and the seat. And then probably come spring, uh, I'll go to Advance and get some of the bedliner paint and get this thing cleaned out. And I won't put some bedliner paint in it and uh, kind of do that. So it'll, it'll look better. Uh, Got to work on the latch on the tailgate. It's not wanting to latch real good. But uh, it'll make just a good truck. To, to I'll put a ball on it so I can pull the my trailer to the farm when i go mow starting next year uh you know hauling trash to the landfill just give me a good pickup truck so uh i'm excited uh mike said he'd be here just in a little bit and uh we'll get started on uh installing the new parts and wish us luck hopefully i'll have me a good truck yes so uh i appreciate it picked up some more subscribers it is awesome uh, big shout out and big thanks to Barry Beamer. He always gives me a shout out on his videos. And I'm sure today Barry's up there in Bethel, Ohio, either uh, running a rollback for somebody or out there working on his place and his cars. So uh, check out Barry Beamer at Beamer and Son Garage. Uh, good guys there. And uh, I'll do a follow up video on old Paul Miller. And the reason I call it that because Paul Miller Ford and Lexington, biggest Ford dealership around. That's where it's sold new, and it's still got the Paul Miller badge on the fender. I kind of name a lot of my vehicles, and so that's what it came to me, so I call it Paul Miller. But anyway, that's going to do it for this one, and I will, my finger out of the way, I'll get a, hopefully here in a few hours, if we get this thing going good, I'll get another one posted and give you an update. Uh, subscribe. I would appreciate it, and have a good one. I'll catch you in the next one.